Cold in here, it's frozen. Hey, what's that noise? It's coming from the back. Hey, pull over. No, you didn't. How'd they get here? He's right by our train. We gotta get out of here. Rent a car or something. No, we can't. It's too risky. The Greyhound, then. It's the same thing, honey. They're looking for us all over town. We gotta get on that train. How are we gonna do that with Grizzly right there? We've only got a few minutes left. Grizzly only knows what Amy and I look like. If he only got a glimpse of you, he probably wouldn't recognize you if you walked by him. So how does that help us? There could be a way. the whole train, Mr. Grizzly. She's not on it. Would you get a move on? If I miss my train, there'll be no tip for you. Are you sure? Yeah. got away. All three of them with the Yeti. They're on a train heading north. Some hunters. So why didn't you catch them? Do you know where they were heading to? Albany. It's the station closest to their house. You have any influence with the Albany police? I own most of them. Is that right? Well, then you tell them to catch the 615 out of New York. They should hold the kid and the parents till I get there. Also, call the Uxbridge police. Tell them to watch the house just in case. 634 Summerhaven. The name is Bristow. Got it? Okay. Lover. I'm going too. Are you kidding? I'm not taking a boy on a man's uh, job. Now listen, Grizzly. Why don't you take the boy? Uh, there'll be a bonus in it for you. How much? Say fifty. Make it a hundred. Done. Grizzly, Mr. Grizzly would like to take you with him. Won't that be exciting, son? <laughs> the limousine is outside, sir. Good. Get my coat, Hayes. I'm going too. Your pet was wearing this when it arrived. Will you be needing it now? Thank you. 
I hope you catch that Yeti, Grizzly. You'll have it. These guys couldn't catch a cold in the North Pole. Now I put a few things in the limo for you, sir. Maybe more without whistling. Arnold, why don't we go away? Greece. Do you remember Greece? On our own home? I'll make those calls to the police. Uh, first, Hayes, pack our bags. We're leaving tonight. And Hayes, don't tell Wesley where we've gone. Oh, you know, I haven't felt this good since I assumed you had ever rest at one. Mike, it's Dave. Thank goodness you phoned. Where are you? Well, we got off the train to stop early. Good thing you did. They're watching the station. Yeah, I figured as much. Hurry up! They're gonna get away! Listen, I want you to do me a favor. I want you to listen closely. I want you to get our Jeep and take it to the Denim Station. We're hiding around the corner from it. Yeah, sure. No problem. My boss is a friend of the Bristos, and I was wondering if they'd been by it all. Nope. I suppose you could spare a donut, eh? Yep. Thanks. They aren't there, Mr. Grizzly. Okay, they weren't on the train when it got to Albany. They're not here. They gotta be somewhere. Brilliant! Anyone could work that out. But where? Where? That's a good question. Where? Lover. Give me the state map of New York. What are you doing? I'm talking to you. What are you doing? Just shut up, Wesley. Don't tell me to shut up. You're working for my father. You do as I say! Look, kid. Just shut up, okay? Somebody's gonna do some damage to you, and you're looking at the man that just might do it. Just sit there and behave, okay? Lover. Get us to the interstate. Going to the Adirondacks. Goose Lake. That's where they are. Mom, how long are we going to stay here for? Oh, I don't know, Amy. We haven't really thought about that much. Can Hank and I go play for a while? Dave, what do you think? Yeah, okay, honey, but uh, don't go too far, okay? Amy! It's cold. Come on, Blubber, we haven't got all day. Marsh! Marsh! Well, it's not that cabin, Mr. Grizzly. Right. Okay. Another cabin a little further into the woods. Let's go. Are we gonna 
check every cabin on the lake, Mr. Grizzly? Every one till we find them. Now, Blubber! Now! 